This is Will with DragonCon TV. Welcome to the Sheridan Grand Ballroom. We are here with the Armory programming track, and this is Night Fights, the first annual Dragon's Duel. These fights are using styles from medieval German and Italian fencing, and of course, this is fencing via long swords. Let's check it out. I'm here with Lawrence, who's the assistant to the director of the Armory Programming Track. Hello, Lawrence. How you doing, sir? Doing very well today. You have an amazing setup going on here. Can you tell me a little bit about the Armory Programming Track? So in the Armory Programming Track, we typically focus on the various objects and items that we have in the Armory. We basically set up a museum of medieval weaponry up to modern era of different items for con goers to ex experience, see firsthand things that typically only very rich collectors have in hand. We have it on display for everyone to see. That is so cool. I mean, at, looking at the weapons that are around the room here and looking that we, the audience is just going wild for this. Oh, yeah. This specific event, can you tell me a little bit about it? Okay, so th this specific event is the night fights. We basically, Fire. most of us are international competitors that go around the, co the world competing in various places. For example, several of us fought in uh, Rome just a couple months ago in the World Championships. We bring that style of fighting here to the con for everyone to see and experience. In addition to that, we also bring in other sword fighting communities such as the HEMA sword group that you guys focused on today. And we're trying to bring the idea of everybody who likes to hit each other with sticks are all a bunch of brothers and friends, and we bring a bigger community of people who like to do that. Yeah, I saw a lot of camaraderie in the ring today. That was a really exceptional experience there. I'm here with Mackenzie and Mary, M&M, and we are going to talk about who won what. Hey, Mackenzie, how are you doing? Good, how about yourself? I'm doing very well. Congratulations. You are, what position did you earn today? I got the Dragon Cons Heroes Champion. That's awesome. Dragon Cons Hero Champion. How long have you been fencing? Uh, going on eight years now. Eight years. Wow, that's amazing. As eight years of fencing, what do you do to prepare for something like this? Um, honestly, I just keep myself active, keep working out. Uh, I do uh, not only do I train with my club and the Atlanta Fry Factors, I also do personal training outside of here. Oh, that's awesome! So it takes a lot of work to become the Dragon Con Heroes Champion. It does. It does. Congratulations, and thank, thank you. you for being here with us thank today. You so much. Thank you for having me. Always, Mackenzie. Mary, how are you doing? I'm doing well. How about yourself? I'm doing fabulous. Congratulations, Mary. What did you earn today? I won crowd favorite. See, we have a longsword here. What inspired you to train using a longsword? Well, to be honest, I've always been interested in swords since I was four, originally from The Legend of Zelda. And yes, I'm a geek. Why else? And <laughs> but really, I just found a very interesting way to keep myself fit and active and yet also learn history because HEMA, which stands for Historical European Martial Arts, it's actually more about a historical art that's to prevent from being lost as it is to keep yourself that's physically cool. fit. That's really cool, awesome. And now Mackenzie, I noticed that you used the long sword as well, but you were using something else today. What were you using? I was using an Italian rapier. An Italian rapier, how does that differ? What, what made you decide to use that? Um, I like more I like more subtle, more finesse weapons, per se. I also love the longsword, of course, but I study a lot of various weapons over the years, I, whether I've been doing HEMA or I've been doing a different martial art, and I just fell in love with all of them. So to me, 
all are equal. However you have to take down your opponent, exactly. right? <laughs> exactly. There's no such thing as a fair fight. you got to use what you got. From the words of our champion, absolutely. Thank you for being with us today. These battles were intense, and we had an awesome time. We hope you had a great time, too. Thanks for joining us. We'll see you next year.